Doberman ear cropping, controversy and considerations. The practice of ear cropping in Doberman dogs has become a topic of controversy and debate among dog owners, breeders, veterinarians, and animal welfare advocates. Ear cropping is a surgical procedure to shape the ears of dogs, often performed for cosmetic reasons. Firstly, it is important to understand the history of Doberman ear cropping. The practice originated in the Victorian era, where dogs were commonly used for working purposes such as protecting livestock or guarding properties. However, as society progressed and attitudes towards animals changed, the ethical and moral implications of ear cropping have been called into question. Many argue that it is unnecessary and cruel to subject dogs to unnecessary surgery for purely cosmetic reasons. There are several reasons why people choose to crop their Doberman's ears. Some argue that it preserves their breed's traditional look and distinguishes them from other breeds. On the other hand, opponents of ear cropping argue that a dog's physical appearance should not take precedence over its well-being. They believe that natural ears and Dobermans are beautiful and do not need alteration in many countries, including several states in the United States. Ear cropping in dogs is prohibited unless it is performed for medical reasons. The American Veterinary Medical Association, AVMA, opposes the practice of ear cropping and tail docking in dogs for cosmetic purposes. Potential Doberman owners should carefully consider the pros and cons of ear cropping before making a decision. It is vital to consult with a veterinarian who specializes in Dobermans and has experience with the procedure if a Doberman owner decides to proceed with ear cropping, it is essential to provide proper aftercare. This includes keeping the ears clean, monitoring for any signs of infection or complications, and following all post-operative instructions provided by the veterinarian in conclusion. The controversy surrounding Doberman ear cropping showcases the ongoing debate between aesthetic considerations and animal welfare.